you so much. Thank you. So excited to see you here. I would love to talk a little bit about how you shot the criminal scene with J-Lo and like how you decided on the song and how long the shoot was and if it felt as magical as it looks while we're watching it. It did feel that magical. It was my birthday, so it was a special kind of magic for me um, and surreal and obviously incredible to, to watch and be in the room. It, it really was an electric uh, live performance and she really had to put herself out there. You know, she was incredibly vulnerable. We had 300 extras uh, and so um, as many cameras going as we could, we kind of treated it like a stunt in that way and wanted to highlight the athleticism and the power of it and there's a theme of control that runs through the movie so in a way that's that's um, that was uh, what determined how we saw her what we saw when we cut and in a way I think Ramona was in control of, of, of what we saw in that scene. What have you enjoyed most about the reaction kind of the reception to the film and all like the positivity I felt at least surrounding it? Oh, it was incredible um, to see it resonate with so many people. Um, you know, I think it's about a lot of things, and so I was really happy that people were able to um, take in all the really harsh elements of the film. It's obviously a really difficult story based on a true story. Um, it was a hard sell, a hard movie to get made, so to see that many different kinds of people turn out and uh, enjoy it was, was, yeah, really meaningful. How are you feeling personally about kind of next steps for you? I know we, there's some nominations we deserved and you guys should have had, but how are you feeling about like the next project? Are you, are you getting kind of in rooms that you were hoping to get in? I'm certainly, it's, it's changed my life. Um, I think that that's what happens when people turn out. Um, you know, obviously getting critics to enjoy some things is very meaningful. Things like this are, are, are meaningful, but audiences showing up at the movies was very meaningful. And um, so having a little bit of everything was, um, was certainly uh, uh, incredibly valuable and rewarding, but also, yeah, it, it, opens, it opens doors. It definitely does, yeah. What have you enjoyed most about kind of the award season as it is so far? Because the film festival and you seeing certain people, are there any new friends you've made along the way? Oh, yeah. Casey Lemons, who made uh, Harriet, and uh, and Charles Randolph, who wrote Bombshell. I feel like every time I run into them, I feel safe. <laughs> um, so many women. I, 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 I've i known a lot of uh, people before. So uh, Olivia is someone I, I've known, and Katie Silverman, who is one of the writers of Book Smart, is a, a dear friend. Um, Laura Dern is someone I love, and uh, Greta is someone I love. So I'm very happy to run into them. And we're both, uh, you know, usually going in different directions and with our hearts pounding. So it's it's really nice to see people you know. Fingers crossed for in a couple weeks. And more rooms for you to get into. More movies of yours to be made. That's very nice. Thank you so, Thank much. You so much. Thank you.